Hi guys and welcome to Tech Based. In this video, we're going to talk about the latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the Canary Channel, which is the build 26236 or version 24H2. And in this video, as always, we're going to talk about what is new, what has changed, and also what is fixed in this latest build. So if you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the Tech Based channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. As in every Canary build, Microsoft includes a small set of general improvements in fixes that improve the overall experience for insiders running this build on their PCs. First thing that you may notice inside this build, if you open up the start menu and then click on your account, you're going to notice that Microsoft is starting to roll out the new account manager on the start menu. It looks pretty clean. It has the micro effect. And basically from here, you will have access to more info related to your Microsoft 365 account, also cloud storage. And you're going to notice that the sign out button was moved here. And also, I think this is a way more polished version of the start menu account manager because we have the mica effect we also have the mica effect whenever we're clicking on these three dots so i think that is good also windows recall is getting a new search the web action for text detected by screen ray in snapshots this was discovered by phantom machine 3 so you can see how that is looking of course i think most of you don't have windows recall but it's good to know that microsoft is working on windows recall and improving it and uh, if you want to see how microsoft fixed most of the security issues with windows recall you can check check one of my previous videos that I've done. Also, this build adds a new sub page to privacy and security settings that lets you control whether apps can use generative AI. And this was discovered by Alex290292 on Twitter. And I think that is also pretty interesting. And there is also a recent activity section, which isn't enabled by default in this build. And finally, in this build, we have a new login animation inside Windows, which I think is tied to Windows Hello, if you have Windows Hello set up on your computer. But I think this is looking pretty good. And this was also discovered by Phantom Motion 3. We also have a new Microsoft Store update, so you can go into the Microsoft Store, into Library, and then click on Get Updates. And this includes the Microsoft Wallet, which will help you make quick and easy purchases in the Microsoft Store using this new addition. In this build, we're also getting some fixes related to the taskbar. Microsoft fixed an issue causing the taskbar to not appear for a small number of insiders in the last couple of flights. And related to audio, they fixed an underlying issue which was causing the preferred audio volume under Settings, System Sound, and Volume Mixer for Microsoft Edge to not persist across restarting the app. Also, we have a new known issue related to the task manager. Microsoft is investigating an issue where the colors in the performance section aren't displaying correctly in dark mode. As you can see, I also have this, but I think Microsoft will fix it in the next few builds. So this is pretty much the latest build for the Canary Channel 26236. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future updates like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.